Today we're looking at two of Canon's better compacts. Well, the only two that you'd want, the better. S110. Better, the better only ones. The only ones. The S110 and the G15. Yeah, very light nice weather. Yeah, it's just, we've got the British weather here for some reason. I picked the S110 because it's the only one that isn't completely pointless. That I is... picked the G15. You didn't have a choice. You didn't have a choice. Well, it's like it's, it's the best second camera, second of your DSLR. After a better but one. So many dials, and I oh. feel like two dials. I feel like I feel like I'm using a DSLR. There's no difference. Oh, it feels like I'm actually oh. using a compact with this one. Big. What's the point? Just a little bit bigger. Well, when uh, it's no point arguing because we have to yeah. get that challenge. Yeah. And the first challenge is we have to pick costume for each other. Alright. Of course, it is uh, Halloween. I'm just gonna go down there then. I've got a very good one. It's All clean. Right. It's clean. We both look ridiculous, but luckily Locke looks worse because right. he looks like he's in drag. <laughs> That's good. That's pretty good. <laughs> What's this actually? Just <laughs> I don't know. I think it's a priest. It yeah. looks more like a sporty priest. Priest who likes football. Your, your collar's hanging out there. You still got a got a cloth. Lace is there. What's the point of dressing up? I know it's Halloween, but no, not my not my choice. I wouldn't want to pick it. Yeah. <laughs> what is this supposed to be anyway? Just... Is it a French guy? You, you're a prisoner. To my umbrella. Yeah. All you right. got seen. You, you, you're, you're a criminal anyway. Forgive me, father, for I have touched too many Canon cameras and maybe taken a few Kinder eggs from the store. No, go to hell. Oh. But wow, that's expensive. Hey, by the way, my camera. Let's talk about camera. My camera got more control. A lot of dials. It's practically controls. the same camera. Same megapixel cam. No. Well, no. raw. You can shoot raw with this. Of course, same I shoot raw since G1. Exactly. To shoot raw with this. Dials. That's what dials. makes all the difference. Oh, that's a dial. Oh, that's a dial. This has got more dials than the EOS M. Exposure compensation. That's useful, really in terms useful. Of image quality, they should be practically the same. Anyway, let's go to the first challenge. This, in this video, we, we are going to set challenge in turn. I still set a challenge first, and then next, next time will be Kaiser challenge. So I will, let's have an ISO test. All right, it's just going to be the same, isn't it? Nope, because it's not, that, it's not the usual ISO test. Let's find a dark place. Uh, so anyway, the challenge, yeah. the challenge is that we go to a dark place, yeah. uh, shoot the same photo with the lowest ISO we can get without uh, motion per hand shaking. Same with the, ISO. With the widest and petty end of the lens. Maybe not the same ISO, uh, the lowest we can get. Maybe I can get the uh, lower ISO without shaking. Maybe, just maybe. Just go in and say you're intern. Alright, and I'll just, I'm just uh, cleaner. Locke was thinking that he could get one up on me, thinking that with his camera he could get much lower ISO. Same sensor, same Digic 5 processor. Should be the same noise performance, but this is about how low you can go. We behave quite well in the church actually. Not those tourists though. They're going to hell. See, we're not using flash. Those tourists are using flash. We're not with them. No, we're not with them. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. It's not us. Oh, my God. Ruined it. I mean, I say that as we dress like this, but they're using flash. <laughs> they're Worse going than us. At the wide end, I used a higher ISO to get a stiller shot, but Log managed to get ISO 100. But the S110's telly end is the Achilles heel here. Its maximum aperture shrinks to f5.9 at the telly end, making this seemingly fast lens compact not so fast anymore. 
I wanted to try an even slower shutter speed, but then God's security guard didn't like the way I was squatting and the dress that Locke was wearing. I think they must have mistakenly thought that I was a real criminal and that Locke's a transvestite. Well, that test was rubbish, wasn't it? Most no. people are going to use the wide end of this, not the telly. But so, what if you want to zoom into some features on the lovely church? Walk closer. And besides, this has got much more wideness. 24 oh, millimetres. 20, 24 millimetres. A little bit. No, well, got a test. Let's find out. Take a picture of the skyscraper with 24, much more wideness and then you have to try and get the same thing in the frame. How hard is it? Let's just walk back Not a little hard. bit. Same as the telly, just walk forwards a little bit. The four millimeter difference doesn't sound like much, as an actress said to a bishop, but there's only one way to find out what difference it really does make. There, there you go. Got it all in. Really? Yeah. You mean from, from the ground? From the ground? From, let me, yeah, let me ground see up. you. Ground up, there oh, you go. Okay. I can't go back. Oh no. no that's cheating to be behind me. Different viewpoint. Oh no. Not yet. Oh, oh not yet. It's really, really hard to walk with this. Is this good enough? <laughs> That's not the full thing. Not yet. I've got the fountain as well. Still not wide enough. Got stuff uh, in the way though. It's a, it's a tree in front of it, if you don't mind. It's got, got a ground. That, that'll uh, do. A top. That'll do. Yeah. Well, it's a tree in front. It's fine. Right. Um, so I was from over there. Challenge fail. You can't technically see the foot of the building. Not that buildings have feet anyway. All right, the next test is the video test. Yeah. Simple, we just make an interesting video. 1080p, there you go. Done. 1080p, same. Yeah, okay. But I can Weird. do high speed video. Okay. I can do macro. I'm going yeah. to make it. I can do macro. Uh, more macro. <laughs> more super more, macro. Yeah. More macro than macro. All right. Times two. Uber macro. Infinity. Ultra Lovely. Max. How can I possibly lose this challenge? Well, Locke is thinking that you can do better by shooting high-speed video, but I have that too. Oh. Yeah, and stop. So close it touch the glass, touch the leaf. Oh, a bug's life. See how can it get so back close? One, one centimeter. Yeah, uh, macro's boring anyway. One benefit is that the G15 can get close to the flowers. One centimeter versus three centimeters. Yeah, well, let's do a ease of use test oh, it's now. Not on yet. And the Lambie user friendliness test by testing user friendliness of a Lambie. Of a Lambie. No. Yeah. No, no, no. Got that wrong. Oh. Cameras. Cameras. Of course. Yes, so we can get a Lambie in. A Lambie! We'll draft a her Lambie. in. Where are you? Oh, whoa. Oh. oh, it's like magic. So we have to take the functions and she has to do it in the quickest time possible. The quickest is the easiest. Let's see. We'll see. Let's see then. We'll see. Okay. Uh, the first one. Change it to ISO 12,800. The touchscreen in theory should make it easier to access certain things. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh. Oh, the touchscreen no, is not there. Yes. Like yes. There. Yes. Oh, and then? Oh. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> uh, no, but this is. Oh, come on. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sometimes, though, you need an actual physical dial for quick access. Okay. Three, two, one, go. G15, it's just the same. Oh, come on. It got the dedicate button there. That's cheating because she knows where. 
It's just written there, it's just easier. It's just Touch written screen. ISO. But the exposure compensation is still much faster, isn't it? You see? No. It's just there. No. Okay, let's have a race. Let's have a race. Change it to plus three. three. Okay. Ready? Or somebody yeah. else count three to one. Three, two, one. What's. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's alright, it's alright. I love my enemy as well. But, um. It's alright. Love your enemy. Make love to them. Don't like that. Annoyingly, both cameras were low on battery. Although the G15 gives you 350 shots over 200 shots of the S110, there wasn't much left for either of us. So I sneaked in one more test. All right, so your, All right. your camera might have lots of features more than this. Yep. But this has got one crucial one. It's gone rid of GPS. I mean, why do you want to post a photo to have people maybe look at where it was taken? This, well, you can shout it out to all your, you know, Facebook and Twit, Twit face. Digital web community, of course. So let's have a challenge. I think it's my turn to set a challenge. I don't think so. You no, have lots of challenges. All right, you, you said that your camera's got all these features, and yeah, that's true. But this tops it all. How about we get an iPad and we test how quick it is to upload the photos. One photo of each other up on the internet. I, I didn't bring my iPad. Can't do this testing. That's all right, because I've got the app on this phone. So I can do it. That means I've won. No, I can, I can upload it with uh, Apple Store. In... Take a photo, let's take the photo now. Let's take a photo right. of each other, maybe. Oh, see how silly you are. Oh no, Lambie's... It's all, oh, it's all awful. Ah. It's her fault. Just set it to auto, shoot you. There you go. Alright, let me quick take a photo. Okay, I'm going to just take the SD card. Give me a head, head start, 10 seconds. Oh, <laughs> It looks a little bit like a transvestite in that though. It doesn't look like a priest. Of course, Locke has to pick the right product. I mean, he's not going to just go to any iMac. He's going to pick the best one he can find. The G15 doesn't have Wi-Fi, but SD cards can be slotted into a lot of electronic devices. Desktops, laptops, iPad by connector, um, blender. You press this button, which is... With the Wi-Fi, you can transfer files to a desktop, laptop, iPad, iPhone, or printer, but wirelessly. Oh, shit. Oh, sorry. Sorry, that's a bad word. I know he's wearing a dress, but... Okay, there we are. Send this image. That was quick, wasn't it? There we are. Now we can put this away. Oh, the digital web app. Look at that. Add photo. Oh, that's done. All right. Challenge over. Just leave them there then. Now you know. Now you know what it's like for girls to run in a dress. Yes, it is. It's uh, uh, a baby. I finished, by the way. I finished as well. But uh, when I log in, I saw your photos already. <laughs> yeah. uh. Both cameras have their own raison d'etre, although I still think that the G15 is questionable. The S110 is still relevant because it's small, easy to use, has some neat features, and it takes decent enough photos. G15 is priced not too much below the G1X and quite a bit above the S110 to make me think that even though it's aimed for the enthusiasts, I think that enthusiasts would prefer the larger sensor of the G1X.